What is proprioception? Well, proprioception is really your sixth sense. It's a sense of yourself. So our other senses are sight and touch and hearing, gather information from the world around us. Proprioception is information about yourself. As you move around, your nerves are sending signals to your brain which tell you where the bits of your body are. We can try this, do an experiment and see how it works. So all you need to do is just put a finger out in front of your face like this. Look, come on, nobody's watching. Put your finger out in front. That's it. Now, put another one behind your head. What you're going to do is bring that finger right over the top and land it right on top of the finger in front. But look, be fair, you need to close one of your eyes. So, have a wink and see if you can bring that finger right over the top. And you should find that you can do it. <laughs> Maybe not spot on, but fairly close. Most people are better at doing this with one eye than with the other. So why not try closing the other eye? Give that a chance. I won't try that version. Notice the difference? Good. What I'm really interested in is can you do that with both of your eyes closed? So we take away the sense of sight completely. Let's give it a try. So finger in front, one behind, close your eyes. Close. Better. You should find that you can do it at least as well as you could when you had one of your eyes open. And here's the thing, you don't need to look at that finger to know where it is, because it's yours. You just put it there. And proprioception is this awareness of where the bits of our body are at. We know that we have this sense because sometimes things go wrong with it. Uh, maybe you've had this experience. You've been lying in bed at night and sleeping on your own arm. And because you've been squashing your arm, you start to cut off some of the blood supply, the arm's gone a bit numb, and you've lost some feeling in it. But more than that, you've lost the feeling of it. You've lost that proprioception. So you don't know that your arm's gone numb until you roll over and a big lump of meat sort of smacks you in the side of the face. And then we start the feeling coming back. The other thing that can happen in some cases is a kind of reverse, to have proprioception when there's nothing there to send the signals. In phantom limb syndrome, people who have had an arm or a leg amputated can sometimes still feel it. They have this awareness of where their arm is, even though they no longer have an arm. So it's a really powerful sense, this proprioception, this self-awareness. You can reinforce it too. You'll find that this experiment gets easier if you practice it and if you kind of tense and relax the muscles in your arm and your hand while you're doing it, it should be a little bit easier to do. Like all of our senses, it improves when we exercise it and the first stage of that is having some awareness that you have it. So proprioception, the secret sixth sense. For more information on our live interactive science and engineering shows, check out our website and connect with us through Facebook and Twitter.